Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the eighth Nationalist China episode, and well, I'm not even gonna go any further with this, so let's just keep going ahead. So, as you know where we left off, we're just gonna make sure that we, uh... Hmm. hmm. Charismatic, offensive doctrine. Hmm. Time to use on my field marshals to help with the, uh... Alright. Since I have free reign over some parts of the Asian Sea, I might as well make sure that they're also airdropped in. Oh, attached air wing? Nice. Alright, I could even do port strikes. Nice. Since not much of my armies are in danger by this point, I might as well just, uh, stop, um, using a lot of my army anyway, so that'll be all good. Oh, high-performance aircraft requires the following technology jet engine. Let's see, 1942 technology. Oh boy, I would I can't believe it, but Poland is still surviving this long even when I'm basically giving them material aid and Romania is just mad overpowered like they're they're almost doing what the Germans tried to do in real life, heading over to Stalingrad, but they're almost closer to Moscow, like my god. I guess you can say Romania is a trusted ally for Germany after all. But I really don't feel like how... They... Oh, wait a minute. It seems like the British are already, are already able to get back on the offensive. I think. Yep, they're already back on the offensive. Oh! Okay, maybe I'll start lend lease, lend lease with the Belgians as well. Oh yeah, outdated equipment. Infantry equipment free and mechanized equipment too. I am the Chinese spy master for the East Asian Orient.
Oh, good. 1943 is where I'm almost about to get. You gotta be kidding me, like... They're the paratroopers in the tank division, but like, come on. Strike on the home island's port. Basically a death, but also a kind of fearic victory. Oh, enemy ships damaged. Okay. Nice. Shot down the Republic P-47 Thunderbolt. They shot down one, but we shot down, but we destroyed it. The damage, the Ashi Japanese ship. Sometimes it's good to keep the pressure on. Another ace pilot yet promoted, and I love it. Up oh, well, Poland is a Poland is a bus now. The fall of Warsaw, Poland has capitulated. Poland didn't stand a chance, but at least it survived until 1942. I can give them that. Yeah, and even Romania occupied some Polish lands, which is uh, kind of weird if you ask me. Oh boy. Germany's gonna have a field day creating those eastern Komazars. Let's see, Tup a Tupolev SB-21. Converted hull cruiser, let's see. Ah, 1940 cruiser hull. anti-air. Let's add a third anti-air because I know how aircrafts can be. The type 933 cruiser. Just want to make sure I know I spelled it right. I think maybe it's time for me I could also try and do a... Another ace pilot promoted. Alright. Hmm? 
Okay, okay, so maybe that may not be a good idea. So. Oh, nice. I, could eat. I actually can try and do the Marines. Nice. I can't believe my soldiers here in Ch here in Japan are actually still holding you know, the line at the island of Kyushu. I guess you could say now I have to do a battle with Okinawa just to like a, uh, you know, not get my armies more splintered. Let's see, what am I missing? Carrier fighter and a tactical bomber. Why would I be missing those? Time to build up more... Inf more ships and infrastructure. Yep, I have upgraded my radar systems to the maximum level 6 level. What now? Battle plans with... Battle pl there are battle plans with no units assigned. Oh, finally, we're actually... Finally, we're at least making good progress. Okay, the legislative one is finished. Oh wait, no, make that the executive one. So, uh... Let's see. Really? Okay. Maybe I can do... anti Iron? Let's see. Prior Maybe I'll try and remove and do welfare. I know it'll increase like my uh the likelihood of things, but yeah. People know a winner when they see one. People Still got to keep the pressure on. It seems like as if the Japanese won't be able to give up without a fight. So, uh... Hmm. Okay, good. Now I can create... There we go. Wait, hold on. Oh, wait, actually. Since I only have my field marshals left anyway, I should be able to use them wisely. 
and all that stuff. So, uh, yeah. First Marine Division. Army is necessary to create battle plan movements. Very low supplies. Okay, we're at least winning and they're losing. But how come it says three divisions of China were winning, but it says we're losing on the offense? Like what? with the convoys I had missing, it was kind of obvious. Let's do a division of 15 paratroopers. Uh, how are those how are those troops still holding the line? I don't know how they do it, but that's all. All I gotta say is that I'm actually really happy.
not even sure what I'm doing wrong. I think I know I'm doing it right, but like... Why aren't... Why can't my ships just... Why can't my... What's your ship? Group go to Okinawa. Oh, that's why. We are currently at war and our troop and our transports risk being sunk. Transporting at this particular route has a 79% chance of being detected and in intercepted. Okay, I guess I could see why now. Okay, so I guess my best bet is with the paratroopers then. Oh no. Oh, that's just great. Now I just lost getting to the mainland. I was so focused on Okinawa, I should have realized I should have focused on. But but it's a good thing I'm still keeping the pressure on. That's all I that's all I care about. Gloucestershire. Yep, Germany just expanded the general government, and whoa, holy macaroni! Mosc Moscow is almost at, at this point trying to become besieged, and Romania already reaching down all the way to like SSR to the SSR of Georgia from the Northern Caucasus. Like my God, and they're already reaching down Sevastopol. But at least the British are pushing back the, the the Germans and Italians a bit up slowly up north from from South from South America be I mean South Africa being like almost the last linchpin. The 34th Paratrooper Division.
Zhang Jian wounded. Oh, he. There we go, remove all regions from this fleet. Wow, now Jeremy just this, this now Jeremy just decided to try and start Operation Weezerabone. <laughs> Typical. Oh wait. oh wait, Denmark joined the Allies, but Germany didn't declare war on it? Oh, that makes sense. But, uh, that's gonna cause a bit of problems. Not sure how, but I don't even want to know. I wonder if I really should. To perform an airdrop operation, you must have more than 70% air superiority in an extra strategic region to East China Sea. Fix that. There we go. All you need to do is add a few extra hundred planes and you're good to go. Let's just say I'm gonna make sure I intend to keep the pressure on. Mm-hmm, we're gonna... Basically, we're gonna para-drop para more soldiers in there, and boom! That'll increase my odd my chances of winning.
Gotta keep decrypting Japan stuff for the next night, for the next few days. Still oh dang! It seems like the British also made some landings with landings for the Japanese. Well, against their islands, and I'm actually ha I have to say I'm actually pretty happy. Report from Ki Ki Kinzu. People know a winner when they see one. I'm not gonna do war propaganda against the Soviet Union. I'm not even at war with them anyway. I can't believe it. Our side is so. This the island of Hainan is still occupied by the Japanese, but like <laughs> the Battle of Okinawa, but between the Chinese and the Japanese instead of the Americans and the Japanese. What kind of an ironic twist of fate is this? Like, it's so weird. All right, then, Mark, we can sign a non-aggression pact. Whoa, ho ho. Yeah. Yeah, Papa Stalin, I would advise you to get out of Moscow for real though, and try and relocate to Vladivostok if you have a chance. That's that's what I would say. Because all of Europe is now against you. Oh oh wait, never mind. Denmark just got flattened. Oh wait. Seems like the British are already stalled or being already getting stalled in Africa again. Oh boy. F Franco's just sitting there on his butt doing nothing. So, uh, give or take. It's just one, it's just one Japanese infantry unit against all right. Now we have Yep, now we fully occupy Okinawa. That means we're all one that means all of us are already one step closer to defeating the Japanese. Philippine Sea is also. Oh, I almost thought the Philippine Sea was in the green too. Let's see. Build support in Yunnan. Oh, I can build support three times more? Sweet. Wait, what just happened? Oh. Oh, good. Komazar Ukraine has been created. Nice. <laughs> Land tax reforms. Our finances are in desperate need of reform. Part of that is part of that needs is to broaden our tax base. German interest in Scandinavia. Hmm. Really, we shall see how the situation develops. Apparently, the situation developed really horribly, I might add. Hmm. 
Well, we may have not been able to get like main, mainland Japan, but at least we were, were able to get Okinawa, so we're basically one more step closer. The island of Kyushu. Hmm. Let's see. Two per oh, the enemy ship's damage, 2%. The 60 Division Plan, Lessons of War, Remove Competent Officers. Hm. Yep, our low inflation. Our, ec our economics have noticed a slight increase in inflation. We should keep an eye on that for a while. Huh? How? Since when did the big icons for the flag change? This is weird. Eh, I'm not gonna let that spoil the fun. There we go, gotta keep everything in the green. Enemy missions, our missions. Yep, we have air superiority of 100%. They only have 200. Good thing, too, because we have 50, 50 anti air guns. My way to build my industry. Take national leadership. <laughs> Why the China Democratic League? already being popular. Reinstate inter-party coordination. Uh, reform the National Bank. A new National Bank will coordinate all financial activities of the government to provide the necessary funds. Great, now Denmark capitulated. More countries are just falling left and right in Europe like flies. the devil shot down by lightning. A devastating loss for us all. They have 82% stability while I have while we both have a hundred percent. Iceland takes control of its own foreign affairs. Alright, that makes sense at least. Oh shoot. Well, time to prevent the ja time to prevent the Japanese from taking over much of my much of my land again. Mm 
嗯哼，我只是。The the southeastern theater. Zhang Ma. Mm-hmm. Yep. The third paratrooper unit. With fifteen troops. Okay. Yep. Now that. Yep. And now with. The, and now with the troops there on. Nice. Mhm. Mm We're gonna be trying to invade the island together as a team. We're gonna take take the island of Hainan back. But if I cut off the Japanese aircraft close air support fighters and stuff, it'll give me a good advantage. Yep, we are currently losing. Yep, and it says right here we are currently winning on these two areas. We took the island of Hainan back. Seems like the Germans just, I mean, the Soviets just lost Leningrad. The fall of Leningrad. Yep, we basically took our island back. <laughs> Sovereign check. That's right, keep the pressure on. We need to make sure that Japan does not... Glout... Gl Gloucester Sea Gladiator. Alright. Come on, come on, come on, you can, do, come on, guys, you can do it. You just need, 
You just need to push yourself to get the victory. The Quit India Movement, yet another doomed attempt at freedom. All right, we're winning. Hmm, maybe I can also replicate the same thing for Japan, but doing multiple, mul multiple infantry and inv like paratrooper invasions at once, mul multiple si simultaneously. That way, I could get a good, better edge. So uh, imagine like. Imagine, like, so many different paratroopers landing. Hmm. Woo! The, the enemy ships damaged the, sa the Sakawa, the killing blow. Alright, finally! The Japanese are now kicked off the island of Hainan in China completely. Japan offers us peace again. Well, the war has indeed been won, so... Actually, you know what? Just like last time... No, we will only be satisfied with total victory. Total victory. Total victory. Besides, I also want Indochina all, f all for myself as a puppet too. Ooh, the Boeing PBJ-1 Mitchell, killing three, four killing blows to enemy ships. Yep, that's right, ladies and gents. We're going to be continuing the war, and we're not going to win until Japan. The heavy clique. I find it so weird that Tanatuva is actually is actually also helping out Japan in its war, but I'm not even gonna bother with Tanatuva. Besides, it's just gonna be annexed by the Soviet Union anyway. So why should I even bother? As and as long as I also have good relations with the Soviets, I don't need that as a as a major issue. So yeah. But, it's, but I still am lucky that we conquered the, uh, the Japanese island of Okinawa. Oh, Italy wants us to sign a non-aggression pact? I guess that goes the same for many others. Italian North Africa... Wait, what? What's this? Communist influence in Iraq. Oh boy. Well, well, at least we're pushing the we're putting the pressure on against the Japanese, but yeah, this is gonna need a lot more elaborate planning, but I actually... Oh! It's nice that the German Reich actually wanted to have an non-aggression pact with me, so that's fine. And I believe this is where I am actually going to stop the video for now, in the 8th episode, because... I might... I mean, I already lost the island of Kyushu for the trade-off of getting the island of Okinawa. So basically, you could say that's the opposite trade-off, but we also kicked the Japanese out of Hi out of island of Hainan. So now we so now we so now we have like a good fighting chance to really strike at the Japanese. But 
for this kind of plan for like a Chinese version of Operation Downfall to work, I'm going to actually have to make sure I use a lots and lots of transport paratroopers and aircrafts. Yeah, just just to make it work like some kind of meme or whatever. Like it may be a meme, but also impractical, but also funny. So I might try that in the next episode or so. But anyway, I hope you ladies and gents love this episode and I'll see you guys and ladies next time.